can you game without being a game? Like, are you a gamer if you don't game on the game? So today, game, I'm, to, game, to, to, game. <laughs> to, so today I'm actually going to argue yes. And the reason why I'm going to argue yes is because I think both sides, in fact, I think all sides, when, whenever this issue comes up, like, what is a game? I think everyone is asking the wrong question. Because the thing is, they're asking an essentializing question. You know, when you say, what is a game? you are presuming in the very question itself that there are these like inherent characteristics that you have to identify. And then once you identify those characteristics, you can come down on like one side or the other and say rather firmly, like this is a game, this is not a game, or this is like some other thing because it has this set of characteristics. This is sort of like a classic Aristotelian way of defining things categorically. But th this, is, this is also then the problem with Aristotle. <laughs> um, the much better way to ask this question, and it's the one that, so this is me being an academic, so I apologize, guys, in advance. But the much no, better way- this is way, what they're here for. Don't apologize. Is what, that's true. This is, you are here for this, so <laughs> suck it up. <laughs> um, the better way to ask this question is the way in which it's been asked in um, art history. Because they don't ask the question, what is a work of art? They ask the question, what constitutes a work of art? And the reason why this is important is because what something is can and often is a function of some process, usually a social process. But if you want to think of it more broadly, you can think of it sort of like as an abstract process or like, you know, an epistemological process or a social process or a psychological process. The I, But the point is, is that it's not about the characteristics that inhere in some like thing in the world but rather like how the world itself structures that thing and makes it be something within it. 